Hey there, it's Will from Growth Labs. Uh, I just wanted to share something with you all quickly today. It's all around how to spy on your competitors and use a free tool to do that. Uh, what I mean by that is how do we go into what our competitors are doing if we're looking for inspiration to write our own ads? How do we know what they're talking about? Um, and everything like that. So you've probably gone through a little bit in the past where you've looked at a page. There used to be an info and ad section here that showed you the active ads that were running. Uh, Facebook have kind of changed it recently and I was looking uh, for some inspiration yesterday while I was writing copy for myself, which is always really, really hard to do. And I came across, well, I went to several pages that I normally look at who I know write really good ads and I couldn't find the button. So I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> like, what's, what's happened here? Where have the ads gone? And what I found instead was that they've actually made things so much more easier in terms of looking at other people's ads or spying, whatever you want to do with it, whatever you want to call it. So um, traditionally what I do or to make it easy, I actually go to the ads gallery in at Espresso, which is a software program we use to split test a whole bunch of different ad copy, headlines, graphics, you name it. Uh, the ad gallery is down, so I'm like, all right, cool. Now I'm going to go jump to the Facebook itself to look at it and the button was missing. So. If you know a specific page you're after and you want to see the ads, best thing to do is to click on page transparency, which is on the right here, click on see more, and then you can see ads from this page in an ad gallery. So a couple of extra steps, it's kind of a little bit more hidden now, which can be good, can be bad. Um, you know, it is what it is. The thing is though, uh, if you click through the ads gallery, you actually see an ad library, which this is, for me, so much cleaner, so much more easy to access and super powerful, right? Because now what you can do is, for example, if I'm looking at Salesforce, I've typed in Salesforce and they've shown me every single page or every single ad rather that they've run or they're running at the moment. So this is like the best way to search. It's super quick, super easy. Um, and you can just go for it in one spot and look at everything that's going on. Now, from here, you can do another one. For example, you guys probably know who Sam Ovens is. If I type in Sam Ovens, uh, it'll pull up all of the his ads as well. I think it only does active ads at the moment. Um, let me just check. I'm going to use myself. So Growth Labs. It'll show up with a page here. And we're not actually running any ads at the moment. So it's not showing any. So um, that being said, if you check this in a couple of weeks, you probably will see some ads that we've got up on here. Uh, but this is a really, really cool place to go and in one spot, find what some of your competitors do, are doing, look at some of the ads and you know take some inspiration from the copy. So um, again, if we come through to here and we click on the ads itself, it's gonna show you a lot of ad details. Uh, for example, this one here. Um, oh, where is it? So it'll show you all the multiple versions and split tests they've got. It's like just a crazy amount of data that they're actually showing on here now. So uh, it's actually pretty cool. Uh, let's, go, let's go back to this and you, know, you can actually see, you can report ads on here too, don't do that. Uh, we're all out here trying to hustle and make it work, so don't be a dick about it. <laughs> um, and it's just really, really easy to use interface, really awesome. So hopefully that helped. Um, and yeah, go out there, look at what your competitors are doing, look at what really good copywriters are doing, take inspiration, don't rip anyone off, please, it's stupid. Um, and yeah, go ahead. Uh, have fun with it. Cheers.